The last time Grace Helbig was on our show, she was only mm -hmm. a New York Times bestselling author, an independent movie actress, and a YouTube superstar with more than 2 million subscribers. That's all she well, was. Well, we're so glad she finally stopped <laughs> slacking because now she's the host of her very own show on E! cleverly titled The, the Grace, Grace Helbig, Helbig show. show. And to prepare for her new gig, Grace recently got some advice from a couple of her favorite hosts. Andy Cohen and Larry King, those two kooky guys. So Take a let's look. say an interview isn't going well and it, you can feel tension and awkwardness. Yes. Do you have like a go-to thing that you Usually do? Usually what I do is start to sweat. It's not brain surgery. Yeah. All right? Thank God. You're doing the best you can do. Mm -hmm. Then people focus on how much you're sweating <laughs> and then they don't focus on, on, the, like, on how bad the interview is. Oh, Hello, Grace. Hello. Grace, Grace, Grace. So, yeah. <laughs> Look at why that. didn't you? Yeah. The elephant in the room is we got to yeah. ask. Uh -huh. Why didn't you ask us for some advice? We, well, yes. I'm here now, and that's all that really matters, right? Not to no. us, Grace. Okay. We like to be first or second. <laughs> I'm very, after I Andy. Mean... I'm older than Larry King. I've had more experience than he has. Okay. <laughs> did, did, did they really give you any good advice for the they talk did. show? They did. Larry King actually gave me really, really great advice. He's very smart. He said he's made his career off of being dumb. <laughs> And, but he meant that in quotes because yeah. what he wanted to. But didn't he mean basically? I thought he meant that he doesn't approach interviews thinking he's smarter than the lawyer, knows more about medicine than the doctor. And he doesn't that, read the books, right? Right. Yeah. That he <laughs> comes from an authentic place of curiosity. And yeah, I think he also good. assumes that um, most people don't know uh, what the, about the subject. Right, so right. let the subject, per, that person, tell exactly. you the details. What about Andy? He's nuts. Andy is great. Yeah. He's, uh, he's got this childlike wonder yes. about him when yes. he speaks that you can't help but feel his excitement, like, just by association. And he's really great. I think he's really good at what he does. What, and yeah. What made you want to step into this pool? Because you have a pretty nice Little gig niche, going. Yeah, carved out. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, I, I guess I thought, why not? Yeah. Um, I, it felt like television's always been something I wanted to try and do. Yeah. And now that the internet has been, you know, a really great moment in my life, how can I incorporate that into something on TV? And what does that look like? And that's kind of what we're trying to figure out right so now. So you don't, do you have a vision of what kind of yeah. show you want to do? Yeah, I want to do a show that is kind of a curious introverts nighttime talk show. <laughs> okay, yeah. I like that. I like that. Yeah, I want to invite people over to my home and have conversations with them and, um, and have fun. And that can happen in a variety of ways. So we have a lot of like activities planned, a lot of like great guests. Um, should be coming on, and I'm, I'm excited just to experiment. Now, in late night, there are a lot of boys. It's kind of a boys' it club. It is a boys' yeah. club. So, Chelsea's gone, too. Yeah, so how True. are you going to kind of make your little way? Um, I'm going to be myself yeah. because I can't do otherwise. Yeah. Um, and I'm going to try and focus on making just a great show rather than think about myself as a girl yeah, in the nighttime yeah, space. Yeah. That doesn't um, do you any good, does it? Yeah. Unless you decide to think like a girl and be something so completely different, your alternative programming. How Pretty about girl, it? Yes, there you beautiful go. girl who happens uh -huh. to be funny and talented. Well, how do you guys do it? How do you manage? Uh, I, don't <laughs> I don't know. I don't read the notes. So that, that's helpful. No, I think it's better not to. I'm with Larry King. I think it's a there much better go. way to go, go. to go back. You How know, what you? we do, the, the key to it is, and it's huh. a three-letter word, fun. Yeah. yeah. If you're having fun, your audience is going to have fun. Yeah. I think you right. guys have so much fun here, and it's really infectious for everyone that works on the show and is part of it. And I think that that's really, it's great. It's inspiring. And just real quick, going yeah. from a YouTube situation, which mm -hmm. is tiny and intimate, yes. to now what it feels like, obviously, to have more people around, yes. does that affect, even though you try to keep it in that same right. I, same vein? How we want to, yeah, I really want to try and maintain the yeah. intimacy and, like, the personal yeah. connection with the television show and that's going to be the real experiment is yeah. how can you maintain that um, a lot of the conversations are going to be talking like directly to yeah. a camera yeah. and really trying which to which you're used to now yeah. which I'm very used to now um, and <laughs> And really uh -huh. bringing the audience in to get to know everyone on the show, to get to know the cameraman, to get right. to know, like... Yep, right. yep pretty yeah. much yeah. doing exactly what we do. <laughs> yeah, I took a few <laughs> Probably for a whole lot more money. But anyway, Grace, Grace we're happy for you. No, we really <laughs> are, honey. You're thank talented. You. Yes. You're a sweetheart. Thank you, The thank Grace you. Helbig Show premieres Friday, April oh, 3rd. Oh, cool. 10.30, 9.30 Central on E. All right.